What's up? Welcome back to Nostalgia. Dave here with a review of Tomorrow Together's latest mini album slash EP, Minisode 3 Tomorrow. TXT, you know them at this point, five years in the game. They become one of the most commercially successful and just consistently popular K-pop boy groups of the last handful of years. Look no further than the fact that they're going on yet another worldwide arena tour, Act Promise Tour performing at Madison Square Garden later this year. They've truly gotten out of the shadow of BTS as, you know, high label mates and have become just, I think, one of the most dominant and consistent male groups. Whether they're at the absolute top during this BTS hiatus, not entirely sure. They might be, though, and Hypen's up there, too. But TXT, I mean, they're certified at this point. They are very big. And, you know, Minisode 3 tomorrow... I'm not super big on the TXT lore. I know these EP releases are a bit more evergreen, but this project, seven songs, 17 minutes, really five songs because one of them is an interlude and the title is just Morse code of TXT. Cool Easter egg there. And then another song is just a remix of the lead single Deja Vu. So really it's five songs. I thought TXT's new mini album, Minisode 3 Tomorrow, was pretty strong for a tight, succinct listen as most EPs would be. This one has a lot of, I think, great songs to revisit. The very first song, I'll See You Tomorrow, immediately grabs you with that kick drum, very high tempo, and this smooth singing from the TXT guys really hits you. And of course, the lead single, Deja Vu, I thought was very catchy, big guitar and drum outro towards the end. I love the back and forth vocals with the singing. I think the production's not quite as strong. I don't think the production on Deja Vu is quite as strong as it is on I'll See You There Tomorrow, but I still like the song quite a bit. Miracle, I think this one really stands out with a fun chorus, very pulsing drums. I enjoy this one quite a bit. Quarter Life made me laugh because you have these guys so successful, so popular, so established in their field at this point. Talking about a Quarter Life crisis, a a bit amusing. Uh, to me. On top of that, the song kind of builds up to, I think, the weakest chorus on the EP, just kind of a shout chant type thing. It's pretty repetitive. If anything, like, Quarter Life Crisis, I feel like male K-pop idols, they could talk about, like, the military service and that being what gives them the angst about having a Quarter Life Crisis while being millionaires, but they don't really get into that on this. But yeah, overall, Minisode 3 tomorrow, I think it's pretty pretty, pretty solid, pretty, pretty cool. If you're a TXT fan, this will certainly keep you going. Of course, not that they give you much room to worry about that sort of thing. They release a lot of music every year, usually multiple projects every year over these past five years. And of course, they're going on tour later this year. So it's certainly not a significant work from TXT. Of course, it's not as vast as one of their albums, obviously. But for one of these small interstitial releases, I think there's a handful of songs to revisit that are worth enjoying, such as I'll See You There Tomorrow, Deja Vu, and Miracle. So yeah, TXC, let me know how you feeling about them. Are you excited to see them on tour? What was your favorite song off Minisode 3 tomorrow? And for more K-pop reviews, more music reviews, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.